Now guys again in this tutorial I'm going to teach you about uh, finding the gradient of the curve at a point. Now the question reads find the gradient of the given curves at the indicated point. So we got the first the first example is y is equal to x plus minus 3x. The point given is 2 comma negative 2. That is the first example. The second example we got y equal to x power 4 minus 3x squared plus 6 at a point 1 comma 4. So we are going to let us start uh, by doing the first example. So let me just uh, have my workspace to be as neat as possible. So for us to find the equation, uh, find the gradient of the curve, so we need to find, wait, let's have it part A, the gradient function. So part A got the gradient function, the equation of the curve in part A, y equal to x squared minus 3x. Now we need to get the gradient function, that is dy dx, dy dx differentiating dy the x that gives you take 2 multiplied by 1 here we got a 1 2 times 1 that is 2 x the power of x reduces by 1 so it is going to be 2 x power 1 so the power of x multiplied by the whole number then the new power reduces by 1 for the whole power minus so here we got 3 the power of x is 1 so 1 multiplied by 3 got a 3 then 1 minus 1 is a 0 so it is going to be dy dx is equal to 2x power 1 minus 3. Now to find the gradient at a point 2 comma negative 2. This first 2 here. This first 2 represents the x coordinate. This one represents the y coordinate. So this one is the gradient function. So to find the gradient now, it is going to be 2x minus 3. Now the x coordinate is 2. So this is the x coordinate. This is the y coordinate. So it is 2 substituted. In x so it is going to be 2 into bracket 2 because the value of x is 2 then finally minus 3 so 2 minus uh, 2 times 2 that is 4 minus 3 so the gradient here is equal to 1 that is the first example In the second example we got b part b we got y equal to x raised to power 4 minus 3x squared plus 6x now, first of all, we need to find the gradient function, that is dy, dy dx. Differentiating this function with respect to x becomes 4 multiplied by 1 here, that's a 4x. The power of x reduces by 1, so initially it was 4, now it reduces by 1, becomes a 3. Minus 2 multiplied by 3 is a 6x x power 2 now becomes x power 1, reducing by 1, then plus 6, uh, this is x power 1, 1 by 6 we got a 6, then x power 0, because the power reduces by 1, so the gradient function dy dx, dy dx is equal to 4 x raised to power 3, minus 6 x raised to power 1, that is just 6 x then plus 6. So now the coordinates of this given uh, where the curve passes is 1 comma 4. So the coordinate is 1 comma 4. That is the point. So substituting this one represents the x coordinate, the y coordinate. Now substituting x with 1 because this one is for x. So the gradient becomes 4 x cubed. But our x here is 1 cubed minus 6 into bracket 1 plus 6. So this is 4 minus 6 plus 6. That answer gets you to be 4. So the gradient in the second part is 4. And the first part. So it's as simple as that one. And uh, that's all about it. So subscribe for this channel to get more uh, educational videos in maths and physics.